Okay, so I wasn't supposed to be back on here until I was ready to start vlogging, but I just thought that this was a very interesting turn of events. So I'm working right now, actually. I'm, so I'm working from home and I heard the mailman um, deliver the mail, right? So I go and get the mail from the mailbox. It's my ex's W-2. He never did a uh, address change or whatever. So now, I am forced, because my family don't like it. Like, nobody's gonna be like, okay, Crystal, I'll give it to him instead so you don't have to deal with him. That's not gonna happen. Hopefully it's not. Okay, so. Hopefully it's not anything like super extensive, you know, it's not a huge, um, and hopefully he just takes his stuff and go because I had already told him like, I don't want to see you. I don't want to talk to you. And I mean that from the bottom of my heart, I don't like, I don't have any ill will towards him. I just feel like um, he caused a lot of destruction in my life. Hey cutie. Hey cutie. What you doing? Hey guys! Looking back, look back. Anyways, I had to help him. He's made, he, he made himself. He made himself. He made his own lunch today, so I'm proud of him. My whole takeaway from this relationship was like, when somebody doesn't know who they are, they'll they'll continue to pretend to be somebody else until they can't pretend to be anybody else anymore and um I just feel like throughout this relationship I was like scammed you know so I really don't like him um he messed up some things he messed up a lot in my life I'm not even gonna lie like I'm picking up the pieces so I just rather not be around him ever again in life because and again it's not because I have because I don't it's not because I have ill will it's because I just I, I just don't want to deal with him you know like at all period like I don't I don't have anything mean to say to him but I, I don't have anything nice to say either so I'm just like so here we are I think this is a test <laughs> says some really heinous things about me and you know, just crazy stuff that, I, that I've never experienced before in my life. But anyways, I'll, I had planned on doing a story time anyways because I just found some pictures of me in my wedding dress. So, yeah. Maybe I'll tie all that together. I'm, I'm gonna sit and think about it. But yeah, I just had to come on here and I guess this is how the vlog is starting. So, hey, thank you. Welcome to my, my, uh, my video. Welcome to my channel. If you are new here, please comment, like, subscribe, okay? Join the team. Join the I am YouTube's new big sister. Y'all just don't know it yet. But <laughs> go ahead and subscribe, and um, I'll see y'all when I get out of work. Peace. I appreciate that. <laughs> this is, this is sad. <laughs> It looks like it's been salvaged. Those are huge. Those are only two bags. This is only two bags. Sheesh. Oh my God! You put a body in now. See, this body. is a body bag. Are they really? Oh my God! I'm about to say that's creepy. I'm say you went to the the mall. Oh, okay. <laughs> that's crazy. That's wild. Dang. Wow. Okay, so y'all, I don't know if y'all can see this clear. Hopefully you can. Matter of fact, let me let me um, get my lighting right. Hold on. Okay, sorry about that. So, guys, um, I have been waiting to get one of these since I 
have heard about Angels with Fran on YouTube. Oh my God, and she finally had ran a sale so I could afford it and I got my box. Guys, I'm so freaking excited about my manifestation journey. I'm sorry, I'm out of breath. <laughs> I was trying to turn on, all, well not turn on, but um, open up all my blinds because you know them blackout curtains. You know, I need them for work. But guys, I just read all the cards that were in here. Get it together guys i already smell this i don't know if it's the candle or i think it's this because when i was unwrapping the um when i was unwrapping the the bubble wrap i i could just the the smell just got more and more intense guys this smells absolutely divine like it smells fun like candy <laughs> guys this is it smells so good guys like I just feel like me getting this is it's a part of investing in yourself you know they say to invest in yourself for like your businesses but I also believe in health and you know spiritually you need to invest in yourself and I took the the leap you know I took the leap of faith I didn't have a lot of money but you know what I'm changing that I decided to get her as my mentor and it, you know invest in what she has to offer because first of all I hear so many great things and then just to watch her lifestyle is it's amazing to watch so and I want you know I want an abundant life so this is my start but guys this smells as good as it looks it's so beautiful and I can't wait I cannot wait morning guys so sorry that it's so dark I'm actually about to open all of my curtains I just decided to go ahead and start my vlog for today it's quiet because the children are away <laughs> but um, I actually had a pretty horrible night but you live and you learn right um, I just, I'm, I want to become more intentional about my content. Um, I actually been doing a lot of research and, um, you know, about YouTubing and stuff like that. And I just want to be more informational, you know, give y'all something y'all can take away from. So I have a new series that I want to get started on that's going to be pretty soon because, I'm just, I'm ready for a change. <laughs> so, you know, just wanted to let y'all know about that. Um, as far as the yard sale goes, so I didn't get to do that today because got some bad news. My sister has COVID and <clears throat> it's very sad. My stomach just dropped like because literally that's really close to home and I'm not talking about just from the heart I'm talking like she lives 20 feet away from me so I thought it would be responsible to just not do one because um, like I said that's just way too close and even though we will be technically social distance I still don't want to take any chances so I'm gonna plan that out a little better be better about what I'm doing but I've been just really going through this whole YouTube business trying to really um, evaluate what I'm putting out you know I was looking at somebody's uh, YouTube uh, video and they were talking about how vlogging isn't a form of value and I was a little offended at first because I'm like 
I watch vlogs all the time and you know they help me get through my day they you know they they're entertaining I feel better you know but I understand what they meant so like value meaning is what is it teaching you <laughs> or what is it giving you like what's your takeaways things like that like you can implement this in your life so I'm still I still I'm still gonna vlog but like when I started off the channel with advice and my story times I still want to do that but in a different way so I'm going to I want to do more informational stuff I want to do DIYs because I love DIYs I don't know if you know that I, I love DIYs and just bring better you know content because there's so much that I want to do I just have to put it on paper like that's the way that I operate when it's on paper it makes more sense and I'm able to stick to it so today I'm going to be uh, making soap because I need to I have a deadline to, to reach um, so that when I relaunch my brand that I have content like I have um, not content, inventory to disperse so I'll be doing that today um I think I'm gonna bring you on but I'm gonna text my ex because you know on that front clip um I said I was gonna give it to him I, only, I mean I'm not like holding on to it for like revenge or anything I just don't I'm trying to get myself to a point of like all right, let's just get it done. So, <laughs> I think I'm going to get up and, uh, not think, but I'm going to get up and get dressed and, you know, wash my face and stuff. And I'm going to reach out and so that I can give him his personal belongings and move on with my life. Because, oh, child. The only reason why I'm dreading it is because he talks a lot. Like, he talks a lot. It doesn't matter who you are, what you're doing, nothing. He will just talk and talk and talk and talk and talk. And, oh, that's why I'm dreading it. I'm not dreading it because, you know, who he is and what he's done. You know, of course, I don't, like, I, I will stand by, I don't like him. I don't like him. Uh, I forgive him, but I don't like the kind of person he is. But... I just, oof. I'm going to have to cut it off, you know, short, because, child, I, I just, I don't have the time. And then I'm going to have to cleanse my space, and, you know, because, oh, I don't want to do that. I, oh, my God, I don't want to do that. <sighs> so, everything will be all right. I should not be dreading it this hard, but I am. Oh, you know what? I haven't eaten today. I need to eat too. Yeah, so let me write my day down and uh, I'll get back with you. Peace. So I'm sitting here thinking, oh, I'm about to have my house rice and my shrimp, you know, because I ordered house rice um, that has shrimp in it, but you know, don't judge me. My shrimp, right? Why they give me, they give me a whole fucking plate of peanuts. Like, bruh, who, first of all, I've never had Kung Pao anything that has had, like, a whole plate of peanuts. Why? Why? Why is there a full plate of peanuts on top of my shrimp? I order Kung Pao shrimp. Again, remember guys, I told y'all I'm on this pescatarian situation because I love uh, seafood. I love it. I've been craving it. I didn't know what kind of seafood I wanted today. And I was like, you know what? I'll go for Chinese. And this is what I get. You count your days, Montrose Chinese restaurant. Count your fucking days. It smells like a circus. It smells like a Jiffy commercial. It smells like a repellent for people who has peanut allergies. 
Shrimp where? Shrimp who? Shrimp say come find me. Count your days, bitch. And Uber people. Uber Eats people. I know y'all out here doing the work of the Lord. And I understand it can be stressful. Like any other job. But I'm going to need y'all to not honk before you send my food. Don't honk. That's super rude. I didn't enjoy it. You're getting a thumbs down. Pass off wasn't great. Would not recommend. Didn't like it. Rude as fuck. I'm just saying. So after my whole meltdown about my food, this is what it has come down to. But I got these from the Dollar Tree. I think I already said that. Guys, these are, listen, I'm not even going to front. With the right amount of um, caffeinated drink in this, listen, amazing. And I don't know if it has anything, because I remember this, like, being a diet pill or something, like, stacker something like I remember that name I'm not sure I'm gonna have to do some more research but guys these are really good <laughs> so I'm gonna have one so that I can go on my day because I did I did go through my list so I need to do this so I can still have daylight and do my DIY and all that good stuff so bottoms up okay so I'm trying to figure out how I'm gonna implement this into this vlog because my ex is on his way first it was five o'clock but all of a sudden he has to come now <laughs> i just want to be i just want to i just want this to be over i just want it to be over <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh my god guys and you see like you can see I'm 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 real bummy. Well, I'm making soap, but like you know when you're in a good place when you're not trying to like feel like you have to impress or like make a point or try to present yourself a certain way, child. I'm clearly over it. I just I'm ready to be all the way done with this. So I let him know in the text like you should get an address change because we don't need to do this. <laughs> like we don't need any more contact period point blank there there needs to not be any contact so anyways mm, we'll see how this goes so oof. well it wasn't as painful as i thought it would be <laughs> not as painful as like oh my god it's oh. no child don't don't play me out like that no like i thought he was gonna be talking child i don't want to talk Bye. <laughs> Bye. Bye. But no, he came. He got it. Um, I didn't even look at him. So I literally, it was just like, all right. Because, mm -mm. anyways, I'm about to finish making soap, child, because I got cleaning to do and I got to D. I, I got a few of them. I have two to do. So yeah, child, on to the next. So look, guys, it didn't come out. It was really shrunk, but it's all big and voluminous. Cannot wait to show y'all what I'm about to do with this. Look at how beautiful that is. <laughs> yes, come through mason jars. More than just smoothie use. Y'all, I don't know whether to laugh or cry. Um, I feel like I'm on the verge of crying because I have been trying to make this soap. This one soap. Like, I had a goal of making four soaps today. And this one soap I just can't see. I don't know why I can't get it right but my mixtures just keep getting wrong this was the first one to go wrong it looks like freaking cottage cheese and I was like okay I added too much titanium dioxide okay well let's try again I tried again and you may think oh it looks fine no it's separating it's separating like Guys, I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what's wrong with me tonight. I don't understand why this is happening, but I am getting super, super frustrated. And I'm not gonna quit because I have to do this, but I don't know what I'm doing wrong. I, I really don't know. Guys, I gotta be done with today. <laughs>
I am finally done with all that soap. Dear Lord. Um, even has some left over, so I might give that away. I think I just I think I might just give that away. Anyways, I just came on here to end out this vlog and I hope you enjoyed it. I know it was a little long, but I really hope you enjoyed it guys. I'm gonna edit it. <laughs> And please like, comment, and subscribe, guys. I'm trying to make these numbers so I can push out more and more content because I'm telling you guys, it's getting greater later. I promise you. I cannot wait to bring out, you know, what I have in store. So hit that like, comment, subscribe. And um, you have a wonderful, wonderful day. I'm going to edit this later.